Hi and welcome back to Sailing LRA. It's Tony here. I have a top 10 for you. A top 10 of my favorite improvements to the boat. Now, some of these may surprise you, others won't. If you have your own top 10, I'm sure you do, please remember to put it in the comments below and we can compare notes. Thanks again for watching. I hope you'll enjoy this. Talk to you soon. Best place to start our countdown at the start. So number 10, rope tidy bags. The boat had none when I bought it and I had lines everywhere. These were a really cheap and easy way to save my sanity. And number nine, the Raymarine Elements 9S. It does everything I need. Uh, it's intuitive, it's easy to read, and very sturdy as well. I never have any problems when I'm setting this thing up. Um, and it just keeps on working day after day after day. A really good investment. Number eight, the Ridge Monkey, the Ridge Monkey. You can cook anything on it. It's non-stick, it's easy to clean, and it packs away small. Really, what's not that I like about the Ridge Monkey? Fantastic bit of kit. If you haven't cooked on one, get yourself one. I've got both sizes, both the uh, normal size and uh, I think they call it the XL, the Jumbo. Uh, either way, I use them both all of the time on the boat and uh, I just love them. Coming in at number seven, we have the Bimini, and I chose the Ocean South White Water Series. Uh, it keeps the sun off, keeps some of the rain off, uh, and really makes the cockpit feel a lot more homely. I'll plan for a proper stainless steel Bimini one day, but uh, this is working really well, and as we can see from the, the footage from that storm a few, few weeks ago, um, they're really, really quite sturdy. I was very, very surprised. Number six, we have the Victron MG Phoenix 250 inverter. Now I use so many rechargeable things on the boat that I don't know why it took so long to get this. Like I don't run microwaves or washing machines or anything else that sucks huge power. So the 250 is just great. It doesn't kill my batteries in only a few minutes. Here we go at the business end, the top five. Wax, number five, hard to believe that $9.80 purchased me so much happiness. This was a simple fix. I was skeptical at first, uh, and I still can't believe fixing that leak was so simple. Number four is featured fairly prominently on my channel. The Water Snake Venom electric motor starts every time, never needs servicing, doesn't kill the battery, nor smell like petrol. This thing has been unbelievable value and continues to serve me well. Absolutely fantastic. So, so highly recommended. Three, we have the Rolly Tasker boom bag and Lazy Jacks. Quality construction, flawless performance. So, so easy to use. It's hard to put value on how it has improved the look of the boat, but it certainly has done that. It's really sharpened it up. And that's really important to me. Number two, another sailing improvement, the Rolly Tasker Genoa on a Pro Furl C290 furler. I use this all the time, even when motoring with the main down. It's so flexible and well constructed. Not having to hank on sails when single handed can only be a good thing.
And coming in at number one, drum roll please, we have the Beta Marine 16 horsepower. Now, this is not only a performance improvement to the boat, but obviously a huge safety um, improvement as well. There's, uh, there's something very comforting about having an engine that starts first time, every time. Knowing it's got your back really gives you confidence to enjoy your boating. Uh, it is solid, it is dependable, it is economical and uh, I cannot uh, be more happy with the choice of the Beta Marine 16 horsepower for my boat.